in building a career clarity circle in a collaborative mm -hmm. way and having you know other contributors um, contribute to the program mm -hmm. um, I also am excited about the potential of um, you sharing about career clarity circle with mm -hmm. your network mm -hmm. and um, because there may be people in your network that are sort of wondering, you know, what is it that I truly want to do when I grow up? And what is it that's truly right for me? Yeah. Maybe I'm financially successful, but maybe it's not feeding me in some mm -hmm. other ways. And so uh, leveraging that and, and being able to um, share Career Clarity Circle, not just with my circle, but also mm -hmm. with the circle of the collaborators is, um, is also really appealing to me because again, it, it reaches um, people that um, I would have never, you know, been able to reach on my own. Mm -hmm. And then of course, the, the joy of, of actually working together on a, on a program and, um, and also the, the huge value of, of being able to mm -hmm. share other resources with the, the people that choose to, to become part of the program that join the circle um, beyond my own um, expertise and mm -hmm. and um, the um, you know all the all the tools and resources that I've built over the last fifteen years, yes. uh, that's you know tremendous in itself. But as a bonus, they also get your expertise and the expertise of the other collaborators mm -hmm. um, along the way. So it felt very appealing from both those angles. <laughs> Also, your your generosity of spirit and how you just love you know to spread word and share ideas mm -hmm. is something that I, I just knew I could count on you to um, to share this with with you know your network and so then again my my, my next question would really be about um, what would you say um, is in it for some people in your network like when you think about like what how could they maybe benefit from actually joining career clarity circle yes. what do you think from somebody who already is in business or you know what what what's in it for them to to actually um go through the process of of really getting clear on on what it is that they truly want to do mm -hmm. well i've had a, quite a few people say to me i want to start a business but I have no idea. I don't I have no idea what I have no idea. And it's not they're 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 beginning to wake up to career clarity, knowing that they don't want to do what they're doing currently. And they turn to us because we're a business network and they, they co come to our networking events and they say, oh, I, I wish I could do that. But I'm ah, there's this hesitation. There's something in the energy. There's a block. Mm -hmm. And I think for those people, if you if you're starting to see glimpses of what excites you, you go out networking and you see, oh, those people look fulfilled. Those people look like they understand the direction they're going. I want that for myself. Then Julia, you're definitely the person for them to talk to. And there's so many people in our network who are almost there. They've come as far as they can come by themselves, mm -hmm. right? And there is so much to be said for our mentors, for our coaches, for our teachers and the people who help us get to where we are right now. And if I had created my business by myself, there wouldn't be a business. I'd be back in nonprofit right now. <laughs> and if it were not for my coaches, if it were not for my mentors, there is no way that I could have had an idea of, of who I wanna be in my business and spread my wings and expand that thing internationally as fast as we, we have. Mm -hmm. Because we are standing on the shoulders of giants. It, it is the mentors who have said, here's how you take this idea and monetize it. And mm -hmm. it's been the coaches who have said, here is how you reach a number of people and speak to their heart. Because I, I reached out to the people I know. So I think for people in my network, if you've got that sense that, that you're, you're stuck or you're frustrated, especially maybe if you're watching this and you haven't voiced that yet, you know, there's, it's in there and it's rising and you haven't whispered it out loud. Because I was like that for a long time. I think we, we sit at that place for a long time before it bubbles in a, up enough for us to make a change. And mm -hmm. sometimes it is, a, it is just something on the clock ticks over and you realize, oh, yes, I do need to make that change. I, I need to begin striving to be more myself. Mm -hmm. And our, our business is called Authentic Networker. So we talk about authenticity in business a lot. We're writing a book right now on rules for authenticity in business. And just like those internal and external goals, when you, really feel, when you can really be authentic in your work, 
in your business means that you've explored what makes you feel whole, right? And you explore what makes you feel in an alignment. Mm -hmm. And if you're in alignment every day, there's a joy in what you do. And then the money flows from there. Mm -hmm. So if that's something that you strive for, talk to Julia. <laughs>